On your mark, get set. Right, right. If you'll indulge me, I'd like to read two pages from advice from the extraterrestrials. Yes, it's true that we have been in contact with your government and heads of power. It is also true that we have been in con it is also true that agreements have been made and kept secret from your people. It is also true that in the past some of your people have lost their lives or have been badly hurt to protect the se secret. Our hands had no part in this. We contacted your leaders because your planet is in grave trouble. Your leaders said the vast majority of your population wasn't ready for anything like us yet. So we made time agreements with your leaders as to when your people would be made aware of our presence. Your air, your water are contaminated. Your forests, jungles, trees and plant life are dying. There are several breaks in your food chain. You have an overwhelming amount of nuclear and biological weapons, which include nuclear and biological contamination. Your planet is overpopulated. Warning, it is almost to the point of being too late, unless your people act. There are better ways of deriving energy and food needs without causing your planet any damage. Those in power are aware of this and have the capability of putting these methods into worldwide use. Those in power view it as a military and security threat. That upset me. You mean to tell me that the people in power have the ability to save and better the planet and they aren't doing it? Amnesty. What do you mean? Complete amnesty to those in power Governments and leaders who have been suppressing the truth that they can't be held liable for any past wrong deeds. It is the only way these leaders can come forward with the truth. It is necessary that you do this in order to work together and survive. <laughs> <laughs>